Hello, let's do Wordle 425, and for the pets theme, Thera Bester Gaming said that they made a PowerPoint presentation to convince their mom to get a gecko, which they named Echo. So they suggested Gecko Power for the gecko and for the PowerPoint presentation. I bet Echo is an amazing gecko. All right, well, we got a G and a W from that and no vowels. So what is this word? We still have plenty of vowels to try. A, I, U, and Y. I could see ending in W, Y, or G, Y. I'm tempted to, I don't know, wing. Is wingy a word? <laughs> I'm tempted to try something like wings, even though it can't be the answer, because there's plurals are never the answer. But this will tell us if the W and G go in those locations, and it's two new common letters. I'm going to think a little bit longer about whether there's a word I can think of just off the bat. Can't be wagon, because there's no O. Could it be TW twi twig? Oh no, I need to use the W to twi twigs. Is twigs better? I don't, I have no idea. I mean, twigs is also not going to be the answer. Um, how about twain? I think twain has the ability to be the answer. You have a twang in your accent, for example. It's a sound. Uh, let's give that a try. Just double checking the, yeah, it seems possible. Oh, I figured it out. Okay, well, it was twang. That's awesome. I got it in three. That's always nice to, to it's always nice to get it in three. Uh, so for tomorrow, uh, I know a lot of you are starting school soon, so uh, I want to know what your favorite class is or was in school. Even if you're out of school, what was your favorite class? Uh, pick two words related to that. Uh, tell me why it's your favorite. Like, was it the teacher or the subject matter or you're just really good at it? Whatever that is. And of course, if you enjoyed this content, then please subscribe.